Scum. It's disgusting. Well, it's the beginning of June. We've used the tractors to work up all the ground. We've flooded all the rice fields, flown on all the rice seed. And things here on the rice farm starting to get quiet. Just because things are slowing down doesn't mean we can take our attention off the rice fields. In fact, we need to be even more cautious because we have plenty of pests which are competing against our baby rice. This field was planted about a week and a half ago, and as you can see, the rice is doing quite well. And that's largely due to our water management as we fought against one of the early pests in the growing process, scum. When you've got standing water, just like a pond, scum is everywhere. It's in our rice fields, it's in our ditches, it's in the grates of our ditch pumps, and there's just nothing you can do about it. Scum becomes a particular issue for the rice seeds when you plant in really hot weather. It just seems to blossom out that much faster. And what can happen, the scum can create a layer on the surface of the water, and unfortunately, if that rice can't get its leaf through the scum, it's gonna die. Scum can also wrap itself around the rice plant, and with a heavy wind, that added weight, it can pull the roots right out of the ground and cause drift to one side of the field, essentially killing the rice as well. Some preventative measures that we can do against scum is keeping our water level low. That allows the rice plant to get up above the surface of the water and not get trapped by the scum. You see how the leaves of these rice plants have gotten stuck in the scum? That scum is gonna keep it sucked down and there's no way these plants are gonna make it. If the scum gets too out of control, we can fly on a treatment with the crop dusters called bluestone, which is copper sulfate, a natural product which helps neutralize the scum and basically just kills it off. But that of course is an added expense, so we'd much prefer to keep our water level low and help that baby rice get above the surface. So scum is an obvious pest that we have to deal with during the beginning of the rice production process. <laughs> it's disgusting. So as you guys can see, a rice field during the first week, week and a half, isn't really that beautiful with the scum competing against the rice. However, once the rice gets above the surface of the water, you have this beautiful, majestic sea of green that's inspiring and super rewarding for the rice farmer. And of course, we do have rice fields that are in that phase. So let's go check out North Sligers that was planted about three weeks ago, and we'll get that nice, beautiful sea of green. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys didn't get too nauseated with the scum. Subscribe if you haven't done so already. Hit the thumbs up button and comment down below if you got any questions or if there's anything you want me to know. Have a great day.